four high converting Facebook ad images you need to run now. I've done over a hundred million dollars in online revenue, specifically with Facebook ads. And these are the four highest converting image ads that I've personally seen and of all of our accounts with the most spend that I commonly see. So with that being said, let's dive into the video. So four Facebook images ads that sell. Number one is a picture of the product. Uh, you can do this in a variety of different ways, but just a simple, straightforward picture of the product. Uh, here we have one from Ridge uh, that's simply just a close up of the product and uh, essentially just stating the perfect stocking stuffer uh, with Q4 around the corner. I thought this would be appropriate right here to share case one that's you know more holiday specific, but uh, you can do a variety of just pictures of the products. Uh, one thing that really sets these apart is the type of uh, you know environment you put it through because you can easily put like a picture of the product. You know, here we have like a holiday theme, but you can easily do this ridge tunks and ring on a guy's finger and out in public and have like a, like a bar life nightlife type of deal around him. So that's picture of the product. I know a really good one also to I see is Rose Skin Co. And Rose Skin Co. did like uh, women outside at a pool with perfectly shaven and clean legs. And they have their uh, IPL, laser hair IPL device uh, next to it. So just another example right there. Now, this is probably one of my favorites right here. Uh, honestly, they're all my favorites, but this is easily my favorite because if we can state and showcase a lot in one image, this is this ad right here. This is a picture of the product in use. And it's exactly what it says. We're literally visually articulating to people with a photo of how the product works. Now, it doesn't need to be this try screen that like is going on right here. Uh, it could literally just be like this top right or this bottom right right here. These are both showing the product in use. Uh, this is more just a picture of the product. You know, I guess it could show it, you know, how it charges and stuff like that. But this aspect right here of actually showing it, it like it's, it's visually showing the product working without like it actually being a video of someone actually using this. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite ones that, you know, it just, it adds life. It, it says more is there's more happening here with, without it being a video. So picture of the product in use. Next one's a picture of the benefits. So I'm a really big believer that people buy from ads and they buy a future version of themselves. So when you buy a product, there's a benefit attached to it, but there's also a desire attached to it. So, you know, another way to say like picture of the benefit is like this example right here where you buy this particular product this supplement for example and we're showing the benefit of getting you know rock hard apps for example another variation of this could be like when people sell and like post a photo online and it's like them chilling at the beach with a laptop and a drink well that's the benefit of becoming an entrepreneur not really but it's a benefit of being able to travel anywhere and to be able to chill from uh, the beach and just simply work from their laptop. That's a benefit and part of that desire of financial freedom that you can articulate to people. So you're just showcasing a picture of the benefit. You're visually showing people what they want and then you're attaching it to your product, giving it to them. Next one is picture of the feature. And this is the last one. Uh, this one works really well for like very sophisticated marketplaces. What I mean by that is, for example, the iPhone right here. Uh, this particular iPhone, this is a sophisticated marketplace. There's a lot of iPhones in the market. And there's also to just, you know, like it's it's competitive. And there's really no, like everyone knows the benefits of this. Everyone knows the desire for this. So this is where we start outbidding people with features. And we don't start outbidding people with features until we get to a stage four sophistication. So when the iPhone is introduced, the new mechanism of a smartphone, then we go to a stage four when we start coming out with new versions. Well, recently I was in Miami traveling to speak at Jeremy Haynes' mastermind and while I was in the Uber driving or riding in the car, uh, we were going to eat at Nobu with some of my buddies and I saw a sign and it said, iPhone 4, like iPhone 15, and all it had was titanium on it to showcase its new titanium color. That's a new feature, and it was a close up of the phone in that specific color. So that's a picture of the feature. Here's a great example right here. This is another titanium ad where this guy's literally just a close up of his new titanium band 
on his Apple Watch. So just a close up of the feature. Again, it's gonna work really well in sophisticated marketplaces where people have already had a few products similar to yours and you just have a newer version that outbids people with features. That's all you're doing there. But these are the four picture ads that I've seen commonly over and over just crush it in all of our accounts. As mentioned before, I've done over $100 million in revenue uh, with Facebook ads. I run an ads agency and also coach and mentor students and both those links can be found below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like button and hit that subscribe button for new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. That being said, my name is Nick Terrio. Peace out.